Disaster imagination is actually a scenario where we think of the hazards that can inflict the most severe damage to us, to our community, so that we are able to plan and implement actions that would reduce the possible impacts of these uh, hazards. Parang lumalaban tayo sa boxing. Kung ang kalaban natin ay heavyweight, dapat ang paghahanda natin ay pang heavyweight, hindi pang lightweight. Mas maganda na na maisip natin yung posibleng worst case scenario kaysa sa hindi. And if that happens, a large scale disaster can occur with around 48,000 casualty with uh, 10% of the residential, public, and mid-rise buildings heav heavily or uh, collapsed state. And uh, essentially, um, many of the lifelines will be affected like water, electricity, and even communication. And the roads, bridges, and even our ports and seaports might be affected. The disaster imagination tells us what can happen if we do not do anything. But if we can do something like strengthen our houses and buildings, then we will be safe even though the intensity is 8.